In the marketing material for the Criminal Enterprises DLC, Rockstar showed off a brand new M16 style assault rifle coming to the game. So when the DLC released, everyone thought that it would have been available to purchase because they figured it was just coming with the DLC because that's what they promoted. Only to soon realize that it's not available to purchase anywhere at Ammunition nor your agency, but some players magically just have it in their inventory somehow and this has caused a lot of confusion in the community over the past few days. I can't tell you how many times I've been asked how to get the M16 on my live streams or in my comment sections. Today I'm going to answer the internet's most asked question of how to unlock the M16 in GT Online and unfortunately, you can't unlock it at this time, it is drip feed. The way that you will end up unlocking it though is through gathering collectibles, and this information is coming from Wildbrick142 on Twitter. There will be 10 randomly spawning crime scene locations scattered around the map at the places shown off in this picture, and what you'll have to do is collect 5 weapon components, those being the barrel, magazine, receiver, sights, and scope, and once you get all 5, that will then unlock the weapon for purchase. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like this event is live right now, so if you see someone who has the rifle, it is most likely because they have a modded account and somehow got it gifted to them. And as for when the event could go live, it could be as early as next week, or we might be waiting a few months to get this. Hopefully it's sooner rather than later. And I also hope this weapon performs better than the precision rifle, because if you guys saw yesterday's video, yikes, that's all I'm gonna say. Based on what I've seen so far from gameplay, it looks to be okay though. I'll of course be doing a much more in-depth guide when it does come out, and I'll let you guys know when that is when we do have that information. I just wanted to make this video to clear up the confusion surrounding the situation though. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, feel free to leave a like as well as subscribe to my channel for more GTA Online content. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.